Hey everybody, Andrew here. Welcome to Living the Northern Life. Today, we're out by my favorite tree on my property and uh, just wanted to check this out. Uh, I'm gonna look and see where I wanna build the house and I wanna put my trailer just over here uh, with a big shed and a barn. So I thought I'd bring you guys along, just kinda of show you what I'm up to here and uh, I'm gonna see kind of what work needs to be done. Um, we might have an excavator in here in the spring. Uh, it's uh, late in the year now, it's almost a new year. We haven't gotten any snow yet, so it's fantastic. So I thought I'd take advantage of this time while we don't have any, uh, all, all the underbrush is kind of gone, all the leaves are down, you can see no issues at all. And uh, so anyway, I just thought I'd bring you guys along, uh, check out and, and, and see some of the plans that we're up to. Like I say, I'm not really sure what I'm up to, but I'm ready to go. think you could use your weed eater to cut down trees I'll put the link to that blade to my Amazon uh, uh, affiliate link for that blade down below in the description so after uh, taking a walk uh, it looks like if we go through about that direction over there, uh, we should be able to end up where we want the trailer over here. Our big tree is just over there. So this is kind of where we want it anyway. Uh, so we're gonna take the weed eater and we're gonna try to clean up uh, a path there uh, to be able to try to get the trailer in here. Uh, we won't be doing that until the spring, uh, but it's a great time to clear this up now. Let's see where we get to. Of course, I just cut a tree down, just took it out of the place and uh, ran out of battery. So um, I, I just cut a tree down. We're gonna clear up some stuff here. We have some other uh, little trees kicking around. I'm gonna get rid of those so I can pile up some branches out of the way. Uh, sorry about that. Here we go. So my phone ran out of space. I wasn't watching it. Wasn't paying attention to uh, all the room that it was uh, taken. So here's my pile of branches. Uh, we created the trail here uh, to bring the trailer in. And the trailer is gonna fit in here, I hope. We're gonna bring in some crusher dust and uh, get a 25 by 16 or 20 uh, level pad in here. But uh, I'll just take you this way. And so we'll bring the trailer down this trail, hopefully. We'll have to move this rock out of the way. And uh, we'll bring it right in here. 
and it'll be kind of opposite where the house is going to be. The house is going to be right in here. We were going to put it beside the nice big pine tree over here, but we're going to move it over this way. Uh, we're going to go get some stakes, but unfortunately, uh, this is it for now because I'm kind of out of space. So guys, it's one of those days, I uh, just did a whole pile of work and I didn't manage the data on my phone, or not the data, but the space on my phone. Uh, so I didn't catch a whole lot. Um, uh, I'll show you what I have. All right, you've already seen what I have, but uh, we've cleared a trail through there uh, to pull in our trailer. Um, we're going to start marking out where the house is. Uh, unfortunately, I can't record any of that because I'm out of space. Uh, but um, when I get uh, get home and get this all cleared off, I'm back again next weekend, and uh, I'll be sure to record it then. Hey, everybody! <laughs> so uh, we just got some cleaning up done here, and uh, got a corner post over here, one over there in the bush. And then there's one here and one right there. <clears throat> Got some clearing up done over there as well. Uh, <laughs> there's my big tree. So, I'm not saying that we're uh, I'm not saying that we're uh, getting started on this, but we are clearing and uh, we'll see how that goes. This is uh, about where our new home is going to go. Our 24 by 36 timber frame with the uh, carport over here. Uh, we're gonna set up our trailer just over there so we have a place to stay. Uh, I'm not thinking that we're going to be able to get to this for the next couple of years, but who knows? Uh, if the stars stars all align, you never know what could happen. Um, anyway, I just wanted to give you guys an update as to where, where what we're up to. It's cold, but I've been working hard. I'm <laughs> pretty warm now. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for following along, liking and subscribing, and leave your comments down below. And until the next one, keep living the northern life. Thanks for watching Live in the Northern Life. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and our website. Remember to click subscribe, click that bell notification, and give us a thumbs up for the videos you like.